These are our our these are our <laughs> FHE uh, brothers. How we doing? <laughs> oh, think, we're a Grant and Chandler. Grant has Oh yeah, Grant has This is Wesley. Hi, Wesley. Look at his shoes, Janae. Yeah. And uh, and there's Bowtie Jacob. He's Papa of our oh, FHE. Well, we have, <gasps> wait, 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 we have a new Papa. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Alan! You can call him Papa. Janae, today, today I ate a whole package of Ritz with Nutella. I'm gonna gain seven thousand pounds and be on the biggest loser, okay? I'm gonna introduce her to Grant. Cause Grant just got his mission call. Hey, what's up? What? My little sister. I make videos for her. I haven't made one forever. He's up on our wall. He just ca got called. Where'd you get called? Nashville, Tennessee. Woo! I'm like doing all a my fist pump. Size bigger. Just There's there he is getting his mission call. call. Right. Grant yeah. talks really cool. This is his hat. Alright, guys, I'll see ya in a few hours. Oh, he's jolly. No. Oh, even yeah. Stevens oh, be the best dang thing in the entire world. Um, so I made fun of Chini on Alfredo on Monday night. And it just sat there in a pot on the stove until today. And then I came home at like. 11 oh, really? from my Book of Mormon class to clean real quick then. before I went no. to Science Foundation. So there was a cleaning check today. And, like, I opened the lid for the pot and it was rotten. It was disgusting. Uh, it was, it smelled so bad. And so I, like, I took it outside and I had a bag with me and I was, like, going to pour the stuff in the bag and then throw it the bag away or whatever. <laughs> so I'm walking toward the door with the bag, and I drop it, and the pot hits the floor, and the feti the rotten fettuccine Alfredo goes all over the carpet. It was disgusting, Janae. Disgusting. It was putrid, and I had to like sit there and scrape it off the carpet into the bag, and then I went and threw out the bag, and then my hands smelled like it, and so I was washing them, and then I was scrubbing the carpet, and then they smelled like it again, and I had to go to class, and uh, it was bad. Sam Wagner, he is beautiful. We hadn't really talked since he came over for dinner, and so he was going to come over the next Sunday to make a spaghetti. But then he didn't, like, follow up on it. So I was like, I guess he's not coming over for dinner because he's going to make a spaghetti. How cute is that, even though I hate spaghetti? So then, Saturday comes along. And uh, we had a ward bake service project. Um, so we met in the parking lot with our ward. And I see Sam standing next to the Relief Society president. So I started walking over there, and Sam was like, hey! And I was like... Hey, I thought he hated me in a way. So then he was like, oh, we should ride in the same car. So we get there and then we just happened to end up right next to him when they're like explaining like what we're going to do. And so then we just got like the line to go get the bags for like the bags that you would put your trash in. Then they were just separating into groups of like three to five. And then those were the groups. And so me and Meredith got separated. But I was in a group with me, Meredith, no, me, Mallory, Anne-Marie, and Sam. It was dang fate, Janae. Fate. And we spent um the entire morning, because it was early in the morning when we got up to go do this. And we were there until like 2, and they fed us. So we were walking around the like 6 mile dune park. And, like, picking up trash and talking, and he's so cute. He loves the newsies, Janae. And he loves Gattaca! Who else has heard of Gattaca? Sam has heard of Gattaca. That's who's heard of Gattaca. Sam has heard of Gattaca. We're supposed to be married. Duh. And we had lunch together. And it was cute, because he's, I don't know, we're just, like, talking. And I feel like I actually know him now. Before, I knew him, and I was just griefing. But I, like, actually know him, you know? And then, afterward, we were like, oh, Grant is getting a mission call tonight. Like, he has it. He's opening it tonight. You should come over. And he was like, oh, I don't even, I don't even know Grant. 
And I was like, okay, well then you could just come over to eat and hang out afterward. And he was like, ooh, okay. Well, Grant wasn't opening his mission call until dang 9 o'clock. So, uh, at night. Um, so then we got back at like 2.30 to campus. I had to do a project. I had to take a bunch of pictures of artwork on campus for my beauty and creativity and to humanities class. So Mallory came with me, and we did that for like an hour and a half, and it was horrible. You know how many steps are on BYU-Idaho campus, Janae? We walked every single one of them. It was disgusting. I went into Mallory's house, and here's Sam walking up the stairs. And the stairs lead right up to Mallory's door, and then right next door is mine. So I'm walking into Mallory's house. And he's walking up the stairs, and he's like, oh, hey. And I was like, oh, hey. And so he just followed me in, and then we were just at Mallory's house, talking for, like, half an hour. And then, like, he didn't know that there was a Relief Society broadcast. He was planning on just staying with us the entire time until Grant opened his mission call. Four hours, Janae, when we had already spent the entire morning together. And then he wanted to spend four additional hours. I am totally fine with that. We go to the Release Society broadcast, and that was a dang amazing. And then we came back, and all the boys came over to open Grant's mission call, and Sam came. And so we were like, oh. And he sat right next to me, and he was guessing, and we was talking and joking, and then, ugh. I can't, I can't even take it. Like, I'm not going to mission prep for Sam. That is not appropriate. But I walked in. He was sitting there by himself. So I sat next to him. Inside, uh, right outside that window. And I was like in back of the dorms. And I saw Sam coming up from where we have church. I see him walk into the area. Like, okay, there's like gates. And there's a little open spot. And then, if you go in the gate, that's like Perkins Hall. And I was like, oh, he best not be going to the girl's house. And so I was like, Rebecca, I'm going to have to go. Sam just walked into my dorm. And she was like, okay, get it, girl. And then, so I walked out. I got on the phone. I walk around. He's walking up my steps. My steps. Right up to my room. He's walking up them. So, I follow him. And Anne Marie's brother was right behind him. And then Sam, like, my apartment... Lights were off, so it looked like no one was home. And then Mallory's apartment, all the lights were on, and the doors open, and the windows were open. And I'm always over there. And he knows I'm always over there. And so he was like, ooh, so he started walking to theirs. He stops in the doorway, and then, like, I couldn't hear what they were saying, but I could hear them talking, so I knew he was like, ooh. And then I'm walking up the steps, and then, oh, what a coincidence, Sam, hey, nice to see you. He's like, oh, a long time no see. And I was like, yeah. And then I sat right next to him. Well, he was in a chair. I was on the couch. But I was on the corner of the couch. You know, they were right next to each other. And I so, yeah, and then we was just talking. And he was just hanging out. He just chilling. He just want to come visit. You know how it is. Yeah. And then he Skypes his family every Sunday at 7. So he was like, oh, so good to hang out with you guys. And I was like, Leave me see how this could hang out with you. I love you so much. Those guys. And last night, I was over at Mallory's and I made peanut butter cookies. And then one of the one of their FHE boys updated his status. And like I'm friends with all of them or whatever. And they're all super awesome. And so what this kid Jake he updated his status and he was like, I have a whole gallon of milk and no cookies. Dot dot dot. And so we we're like, Hello, start about it, Jim. So we went over there. We okay and. Creep. She just opened the door and put the cookies on the ground in her apartment. And then we were running because I didn't want to get caught. And then we went back to see if they were gone. And they were gone. And then Colin opened the door and was like, just come in. And so then we went in there and we were talking. And um, and they're super cute. And then Colin was like, hey, you girls should come over for dinner tomorrow. And we're like, yes. Because Colin, Colin's really cool. And so is Jackson. They're like best friends. And then there's Jake and Grace, he's from Uganda, and he be dang loving Mallory. Like, he's legitimately in love with her. He, like, hecka likes her. So we're going over to their house to have French toast. What dinner? Tonight. So there's this uh, apartment downstairs and across, like, 
way, they're like the first apartment downstairs, and we're almost the last apartment upstairs on the opposite building, so like, and there's this guy, and he's British, and he's beautiful, and he's dating one of the girls in that apartment, <laughs> and so the, the, the girl's apartment that's across from the one where British Ben, that's his name, Ben, uh, where British boy Ben is dating that girl, so, like, they're downstairs right here, in the apartment up here and across, like, at night, Ben will come over and is, like, hanging out with his girlfriend. And they're, like, making out in the kitchen and being super awkward and inappropriate. <laughs> so these girls, they started a TV show. And they made a Facebook page. It's called Across the Pond. Because, like, people say that, you know, when they talk about Britain, like, oh, across the pond. Like, the Atlantic Ocean is a dang pond, even though it's thousands of miles. Anyway, so they call it Across the Pond. And if you join the group... Then you can see, like, okay, they'll update it, and they'll be like, new episode right now. <laughs> and so everybody goes to their apartment, like, two at a time. The lights are off. So everybody will go into Tam Tamsin is the name of the girl who lives in that apartment. And so, like, everybody will go to Tamsin's apartment, and she has the lights off, but the windows are open. And so you and they're upstairs. And so you can't see into her apartment from where Ben is, but we can see everything they're doing. And there's a rule, like, if you have boys over, your blinds have to be up. And so we can see everything that they're doing. And it is hilarious. They, they're they crazy. Like, this couple was insane. They were fighting and screaming at each other and, like, throwing things at each other. And then, like, two minutes later, they're making out in the kitchen. And I'm like, you are so awkward.